That's right, baby. This is what you've been waiting for. You don't want the Steve Dolls up here. You want the Latin lover because this is Fiesta Garden, baby, not Rocker's Corner. I'll tell you what. Next Thursday, we're going to be in Salem, and the wrecking crew there is in a big, big tag match. And then Friday in Eugene, there's a big battle royal. And making his first appearance in Eugene in a long time, whoopee do, who cares, is Rip the Crippler Oliver. Yeah. Ask me if I care about you, Rip Oliver. So I'll tell you what. I know you want to come out here into the Fiesta Garden, so I'll wait for Rip the Crippler Oliver to get out here and talk to you people. He makes me sick. He smells like a spotted owl for cr uh, Can't believe it. Yeah, well, he's coming. He's coming up here to the Fiesta Garden. Rip Oliver. He's got a big tag match in Salem. He doesn't even have a partner. That makes a lot of sense to me. First time in Eugene in years. Rip Oliver, whoopee doo. A whoopee doo to you, Mr. Al Madrill. The Lane County Fairground, Daddy, used to be one of my favorite spots in the Northwest here. Well, all you fans around Springfield, Eugene, all you loggers come out, Daddy, and back the Crippler up, and you gonna see the Crippler leaving there with a $1,500 purse. The Spotted Owl may put me out, but I'm gonna win the battle royal, and I'm gonna keep on going, buddy. Well, that remains to be seen, Rip. I've seen Crappler done teared you up from limb to limb. One more question I want to ask you, Rip the Crippler, is you got a tag match in Salem, a big show there. Where is your partner? You don't even have a partner. Nobody even wants to be your partner. What do you mean nobody wants to be my partner? I know there's not one guy back there that could give a damn about me, Al Madrill. <laughs> I'm one of them. But there's one guy back there that I know that wants Brian Adams, and he wants the grappler. So, this week, I let Billy Jack Haynes view some tapes of my brother. I don't care about Bill, Billy Jack. Okay, Billy Jack don't know nothing about this, but if you're back there watching the monitor, Billy, you said you'd be my partner here tonight because you owed me one. Well, we're going to be a tag team here in just a few minutes. But Thursday night in Salem, the last time I was in Salem was Thanksgiving. Well, I'm coming back down there this Thursday night. Sandy Barr has already, Sandy Barr has already signed a title match, tag team title. Well, I don't have a partner. But I'm asking for one right now. Wait a minute, Billy Jack. Didn't you tell me that you didn't like this guy and everything he stood for? Didn't you tell me that? Listen, Madrill, I know he don't like me. I'm talking about putting two guys down on the mat for the count of three for their belts. What about all the times he slapped your face? All the times he did to you? Remember those things, Billy Jack? You're not that dumb. You've got to remember what this man did to you. Or don't you? Now why don't you just shut up, burrito breath? Burrito! Yeah, burrito breath. Now let me say a few words. I'm not going to scream and yell, Rip. Listen, Billy, I'm not asking you for a date. I'm asking you to be my partner in a tag team title match for the Northwest Tag Team Championship belt in Salem Thursday night. Will you do it? I wouldn't. You show me some tapes this week, because I don't know who to trust anymore. Brian Adams let me down. Look all you've done to me, Rip. I don't know who to trust, but I did see the tapes. I seen what he done to your son, the grappler, and I seen what he done to your brother that hasn't got no leg. So you helped me out last week. I owe you one, brother, and I'll make it go further than this. I owe you two. I'll be your partner, but don't expect me to shake your hand until you prove yourself to me, period. Well, Billy Jack Haynes, listen to this. The goal is, for me has always been this right here, Daddy, the greenbacks. When you're carrying them belts, you're making the greenbacks. Like I said, I'm not asking you out on a date, boy. I don't want to go out on a okay. date. Okay. I want to well, fight these guys. Well, let's be my partner in Salem like you're my partner here 
And let's take and clean these damn guys up and get them out of here. He's doing a step here. Shake your hands and get out of here. Burrito breath. As the stomach turns, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be back next week in the Fiesta Garden. It's Tom's Happy Holiday Sale. Zenith Remote Color Televisions on sale. Save $100 on this 25-inch Zenith Colored Console, only $497. Or save $62 on this 19-inch Zenith Colored TV, only $297. Or $397 buys this 25-inch Zenith Colored TV. And it's yours today for only $20 a month. Now that's Tom Peterson's The Happy Place to Buy. It's worth the trip. You can't go wrong with Zenith. A great set. Here's one of the sets you just looked at on the television commercial. Zenith, 19-inch, and it's a remote, and there's the price, $297. You save $62 when you buy this set. It's our number one selling 19 or 20-inch remote. It's a great set. The brand name is Zenith. There's the price, $297. We're open tomorrow right after church at 10 a.m. in the morning. Don't miss it. You never know what you'll find at Sandy Bar's Flea Mart. Open from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. every Saturday and Sunday at the Sports Arena, 8725 North Chautauqua. Two big buildings filled with jewelry, toys, tools, children's clothes, glassware, new items, old items, and good food. Come on out and see for yourself every Saturday and Sunday at the Sports Arena. It's Sandy Bar's Flea Mart. Take I-5 to the Lombard West exit, go nine traffic lights, turn right, and it's just four more blocks.